states and local educators are working their fingers to the bone trying to do what's right for kids. I think we owe them the courtesy of treating them like the professionals they are and giving them the opportunity to get their ducks in a row before we start giving them the bare, the bare bubs treatment. Nobody said this was going to be easy. I used to run one of the largest school districts in the United States of America, so I know change is not easy, especially on a scale as large as this. We're applying historic new ground here, and I'm confident that we'll succeed. And the reason I'm confident is, is because it is already succeeding around the country. For example, take in Indiana. In Indiana, they put their school's performance out for everyone to see. They put it on their website, in the newspapers, on the radio, so I know that this can be done. In Alabama, it's succeeding. Alabama hit the ground running with the Reading First Initiative. In just two months this summer, they trained 2,300 teachers in solid research-based reading instructions. Clearly, this can be done. In St. Paul, Minnesota, in the St. Paul public school system, they jumped at the opportunity to provide parents with greater choice. They placed nearly all who applied to transfer to the schools of their choice. So clearly, this can be done. Colorado Springs, for example, identified where students need help and they're providing the parents with lists of supplemental services providers. So, it can be done. Now someone else who knows that this can be done is Joyce Bales, a superintendent of the Pueblo school system in Colorado. To Dr. Bales, low income does not mean low expectations. She believes that every child can learn. So all the things that the president and I talk about, she did. She got a research-based reading program. She trained her teachers. She got the parents involved. She set high expectations and demanded results. And so people now in Pueblo know what history has shown. When you raise the bar, people rise to meet the challenge. So achievement in Pueblo now is soaring.